Hey, so as you can see by the title, I am now seven months on testosterone. To be honest, it still feels like no time's passed since I filmed my six months, but here we are. Also, I just got a new phone, finally, after saving up for like six months. And I'm filming on that now, so it might look a little bit different. Let me know what you think, and if it looks better. I am now seven months on testosterone. If it looked better before, I can always use my iPhone just to film videos on, because it's useless for anything else. That's why I need a new phone. The battery dies in an hour. And if I film a video, it goes from like 100% to like 20. So yeah, if you do prefer the old one, I can always film on that. But yeah, so anyway, on to the changes that I've experienced this month. This is going to become a recurring theme, I think, but not a lot has happened. It's getting to that point where like, at the beginning, loads of changes happen all at once, and then it's kind of sparse, and then more different, more exciting ones happen after like a year. Yeah, for the next couple of months, it's just going to be a few little things. But first of all, again, as I've said in every month, thigh hair. Yep, it's still coming in. It's weird, it just seems like every time I look down, there's more there. I'm guessing that's just going to keep slowly covering more of my legs until I actually have full thighs of hair. And then we also have belly hair. Again, that is still coming in a little bit. Still next to nothing really, but it's very slightly getting darker and there's a bit more of it now. And it blows my mind honestly when you see lads getting like full-blown hairy stomachs only a couple of months in. But I'm glad that's not happened to me. Another thing, and I don't know if I mentioned this actually, I think I might have forgotten to mention it in whatever month it was, I can't remember now. Probably around three or four months, maybe. I noticed that uh, my arms, which is a little bit, you don't just put on muscle by being on testosterone, but you could, you can actually like feel that there's a little bit of muscle there, whereas before it just felt like flab. So I guess the muscle that I had, or from just doing normal things, a little bit of muscle had built up. If I did that, you couldn't really see it. It looks pretty much the same as it did. There's, there's like nothing there, there is no muscle. But compared to what it was, it's a little bit more defined, I guess, because you can actually feel it. But in the last month, I've just kind of noticed, I don't know if I've just become more aware of it, and it's a thing that's already happened, or if it's a new thing. But I've just noticed that it's like easier to lift things. Not like particularly anything, I'm not like doing any weights or anything, although I do need to go and pick up my granddad's old weights from my grandma's house. I'm gonna start using them, so hopefully I'll have some proper muscles. But just like normal things lifting, like shopping bags and just anything really, it just seems like it's easier to lift things, it's less strain. Then I just feels like I might be getting a little bit stronger, which is cool. And then the last thing is facial hair. Now I have a few black goatee hairs that I just noticed one day, like a couple of weeks ago. They're still really not noticeable if you're just looking at me. Like, if you look at me, you can see my moustache, but you can't really see that. Then it's because it's in that little divot, and there's only a few of them. So yeah, you won't really see it unless you, like, really looked, but it is there, and it's nice to know that it's there. I also haven't shaved my face since last month, because I figured that it just makes it harder to realise if there's any new hairs coming in. If I'm constantly shaving them off, they don't really have time to grow in enough for me to notice them before I shave them off again. Especially if they're just starting to be like black hairs and not like really thick. And yeah, honestly, I can't really say that I've noticed anything else. These updates are definitely going to get shorter and shorter towards the year, I think. But yeah, anyway, that's that, I guess. As always, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like. And if you want to see more from me, subscribe with notifications turned on. And if you like, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter or Instagram, just at jaysjourneyftm. So yeah, thanks for watching, come on my journey, and I'll see you next video.